I started the company in the sample management group about four years ago. Certainly didn't have the level of automation we had now. I work in sample management, uh, which at Behringer is sort of merged with the automation department. A lot of crossover between the two departments because sample management is so automation intensive. Recently we built the uh, automated liquid processing system uh, from Thermo and it's, it's really changed everything. We've accomplished what would have taken probably a couple years in this first year. So. Uh, you know, it's been, an, it's been an amazing change there. I think one of the big things you'll see in the future is uh, more of an inter interaction between automation and data. The system actually using data that it gets in real time and making decisions based on that. We work with the uh, entire DIM4 platform. The entire platform uh, we, we found to be very reliable, uh, very robust. We've also got a number of uh, sort of industrial grade uh, articulating arms, the FANUC F5s. The combination of those and the integration really works well. The system itself is uh, quite large, I believe around 1,000 square feet. It's actually two systems uh, that are mirror images of each other uh, that are capable of running in parallel or as one whole unit. The throughput of the system, it's very hard to describe because we our, all of our campaigns are very different. We generally targeted uh, a throughput of one minute per microplate uh, generation. It's tough to measure because our system before this it was, we, it was confined to an eight hour day. Now we run 24 hours a day, we have remote monitoring, we can er handle most errors remotely. I can be sitting on my couch in my living room, log into my uh, computer, remote into the desktop. I, we have surveillance cameras and we're able to recover from errors and, and continually run. We get three times the amount of time to uh, process samples as we did before.